I am, Bible verses that say I am, Bible verses that say I am. Bible verses that say I am 1, Exodus 3 14, God said to Moses, I am who I am. This is what you are to say to the Israelites, I'm has sent me to you. This verse is a declaration from God that he is the self-existent, eternal, and all-powerful creator. 2, Isaiah 41 10, So do not fear, for I am with you, do not be dismayed, for I am your God, I will strengthen you and help you, I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. This verse is a reminder that God is with us, and he will always help us during times of fear and doubt. 3, Isaiah 43 1, But now, this is what the Lord says, He who created you, Jacob, he who formed you, Israel, do not fear, for I have redeemed you, I have summoned you by name, you are mine. This verse reminds us that God has created us and has a special purpose for our lives. 4, John 8 58, Very truly I tell you, Jesus answered, Before Abraham was born, I am. This verse is a declaration from Jesus that he is the eternal, self-existent I am. 5, John 10 7, Therefore Jesus said again, Very truly I tell you, I am the gate for the sheep. This verse reminds us that Jesus is the gate that leads us to salvation. 6, John 14 6, Jesus answered, I am the way and the truth and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. This verse is a reminder that Jesus is the only way to salvation. 7, Romans 8 31, What, then, shall we say in response to these things? If God is for us, who can be against us? This verse reminds us that God is always on our side, no matter the situation. 8, Romans 8 38-39 For I am convinced that neither death nor life, neither angels nor demons, neither the present nor the future, nor any powers, neither height nor depth, nor anything else in all creation, will be able to separate us from the love of God that is in Christ Jesus our Lord. This verse reminds us that nothing can separate us from the love of God. 9 2 Corinthians 4 18 So we fix our eyes not on what is seen, but on what is unseen, since what is seen is temporary, but what is unseen is eternal. This verse reminds us to remember that the things of this world are passing away, but God's promises are eternal. 10. Galatians 2:20. I have been crucified with Christ and I no longer live, but Christ lives in me. The life I now live in the body, I live by faith in the Son of God, who loved me and gave himself for me. This verse is a reminder that Jesus lives inside of us, and we should live our lives in faith. 11. Philippians 4:19 and my God will meet all your needs according to the riches of his glory in Christ Jesus. This verse reminds us that God will provide for us according to his riches and glory. 12. Colossians 3:17. And whatever you do, whether in word or deed, do it all in the name of the Lord Jesus, giving thanks to God the Father through him. This verse reminds us to do all things in the name of Jesus and to give thanks to God. 13. 1 Peter 5 7. Cast all your anxiety on him because he cares for you. This verse reminds us to cast all our worries onto God, knowing that he cares for us. 14. Psalm 46 10. Be still, and know that I am God. I will be exalted among the nations. I will be exalted in the earth. This verse is a reminder that God is sovereign over all the nations and all the earth. 15. Psalm 73 26. My flesh and my heart may fail, but God is the strength of my heart and my portion forever. This verse reminds us that even when we are weak, God is our strength and our portion forever. 16. Proverbs 3 5 6. Trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding. In all your ways acknowledge Him, and He will make your path straight. This verse reminds us to trust in God and acknowledge Him in all our ways. 17. Isaiah 40 28. Do you not know? Have you not heard? The Lord is the everlasting God, the creator of the ends of the earth. He will not grow tired or weary, and his understanding no one can fathom. This verse is a reminder that God is everlasting, and his understanding is beyond us. 18. Isaiah 41 13. For I am the Lord, your God, who takes hold of your right hand and says to you, Do not fear, I will help you. This verse is a reminder that God is always with us, and he will never leave us. 19. Isaiah 43 10. You are my witnesses, declares the Lord, and my servant whom I have chosen, so that you may know and believe me and understand that I am he. Before me no God was formed, nor will there be one after me. This verse is a reminder that God is the only true God and there is no other. 20. Jeremiah 29 11. For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you hope and a future. This verse reminds us that God has a plan and purpose for our lives, and he will give us hope and a future. 21. Matthew 28 20, And surely I am with you always, to the very end of the age. This verse is a reminder that Jesus is always with us, no matter the situation. 22 2 Timothy 1 7. For God did not give us a spirit of timidity, but a spirit of power, of love and of self-discipline. This verse reminds us that God has given us the power to live a life of love and self-discipline. 23. 
Hebrews 13 5, Keep your lives free from the love of money and be content with what you have. Because God has said, Never will I leave you, never will I forsake you. This verse reminds us that God will never leave us or forsake us, no matter what. 24 1 John 4 4, You, dear children, are from God and have overcome them, because the one who is in you is greater than the one who is in the world. This verse reminds us that the power of God is greater than the power of the world. 25, Revelation 1 8, I am the Alpha and the Omega, says the Lord God, who is, and who was, and who is to come, the Almighty. This verse is a reminder that God is the Alpha and Omega, the beginning and end of all things, and He is all-powerful. Jesus saying He is God, Divinity, I Am, PDF, Quiz, Bible Verses, Unique Facts, Class, Father, Grandfather, Minister, Missionary, Deacon, Elder, Author, Welcome to our family, View All Posts.